Chinese state media wants us to believe that Peng Shuai lied. The 35-year-old double Grand Slam winner and one of the country's most famous sports stars poured her heart out on social media about years of sexual abuse, but two weeks later has decided she made the whole thing up. There is just one problem with that narrative. The email in which she supposedly reassured the world she was not missing or unsafe had all the hallmarks of a fake. Not least the mouse cursor, bizarrely visible in the second line of text. The head of the Women's Tennis Association said he had a hard time believing the email was from Peng herself and has threatened to pull out of future tournaments in China. Peng Shuai has accused the former Chinese Vice Premier Jiang Gaoli of forcing her to have sex with him. The letter she posted online detailing the allegations sent shockwaves through the Communist Party and the country's fragile Me Too movement. She hasn't been seen or heard from since. There has been no response from the government or Jiang himself. Today, the Chinese Foreign Ministry again refused to comment on the matter. Naomi Osaka is among the growing number of fellow players who have raised their concerns with the hashtag Where is Peng Shuai? And despite the government's censorship, it appears Peng's claims have been heard by the Chinese public. But people in Beijing were cautious to speak on such a controversial issue. We have no way to verify the claims made by Peng Shuai. But faced with this scandal, the Chinese government has shown itself to be incapable of allowing due process. Debbie Edward, News at 10, Beijing.